Hi, Wes Scott from LifeBack Law Firm. And today we're going to talk about uh, bank accounts closing during bankruptcy in Minneapolis, Minnesota by Dr. Amanda Rosbach. You know, uh, we do warn people about a couple things. One, it's always dangerous to bank at a bank where you owe them money. And a lot of people don't know that banks have the right to go into your account and take whatever money you have and offset it with what you owe them at any time. Even if you're current at the payment, don't matter. Banks have the right to do this. It's called the right of offset. And a lot of people don't know this. Um, I think it's dangerous. Now, whether a bank will close your account because you filed bankruptcy on a debt you might owe them is a different matter. If the bank is considered a chartered bank, U.S. Bank, Wells Fargo, a lot of the bigger banks, you know, they cannot close your account because you filed a bankruptcy. But if it's not a chartered bank, say it's a credit union, um, credit unions can boot you out and they routinely do. And, and part of the reason for that is, you know, like when you bank at a credit union, for example, you are not only uh, um, a customer, but you are a shareholder, part owner of the bank, you know, teeny, tiny, tiny, tiny. But you have an agreement with the bank, you know, of which you own a part of it, that you will not cause the bank a loss. And if you cause the bank a loss, they can boot you out and they will. So uh, we would I would tell you, we would tell you in an abundance of caution, and I would tell you, don't, don't do anything until you talk to your lawyer about this. But we do often suggest opening, opening up an account at a bank where you do not owe them money and redirecting your deposits into your new account when the time is right. When you are ready to get your life back, reach out to LifeBack Law Firm. You're going to be so thankful you did.